Hey, 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 everybody. Happy Health and Wellness Wednesday. Yes, 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 y'all. Yes, everybody. I went to Aldi's. So let's see what's in my bag. I went to Aldi's um, a few days ago so that I could um, get some healthy snacks and some healthy um, breakfast items. So I'm going to show you what I got. So the first up is I got some organic coconut chia granola cereal and it is absolutely delicious i also purchased some um coconut milk to have with it but i will say that you can also like um because it is granola you can eat this like with yogurt and things like that and y'all i do apologize for the lighting um <coughs> i'm at the gymnastics building my daughter's inside. There's a lot of trees around here. But this is the only time I will have to make this video. So here we are. So yes. Yeah, so let's see. Nutritional facts. It is 280 calories. And a serving is 3 4 cup. And it has 45 milligrams of sodium. So that's really good. And I'm trying to see the sugars. Total sugars is 12 grams. So this right here. And I have my receipt right here. So the price of this cereal. Because y'all know. I mean I didn't catch anything on sale. The original coconut. Oh no I bought some other stuff. What is this? Where is the cereal? How come? What? <laughs> uh, okay coconut milk. Yo, did I not ring it up? Y'all, did I not ring it up? Oh, I see it. I'm about to say, oh my goodness. Okay, so it says organic granola. It doesn't say coconut. So the organic granola was two seventy nine. dollars Y'all, I, I was about to say, oh my God. I, ooh. Baby, I thought I done ran out the store without paying. No, uh-uh, I didn't. This was two seventy nine. dollars Y'all, I was so scared just now. Okay, but on my receipt, it doesn't say coconut. It just says organic granola. And this was $2.79. So that's that, y'all. Okay. So then next up, I'm just grabbing out the bag. I got some raw agave. So this is raw blue agave. And it says that it's organic. Y'all can see I already had some. All right, I, I just... You know, I've been using this. I've been using this to sweeten my um organic coffee and my organic tea. So I have been using this already. So the bottle is full. So don't let that trick you. But this is a very good alternative to sugar. You know, when you are on your health and wellness journey, you definitely, especially if you are a, a cancer patient or a cancer conqueror, you definitely need to limit your sugar, okay? And so, this is an alternative to sugar. This agave nectar. It is super sweet. And for some people who are vegan, um, they don't, like, use honey or anything. I think vegans can use agave nectar. I'm not sure, but I think that they can. So, the agave nectar was $4.49 for that bottle. Okay, next up are these whole almonds and they are plain okay i like the plain almonds i normally get the blue diamond but everywhere i have gone and i haven't been to walgreens in a while blue diamond is so expensive for the small little can and um either they don't have the plain ones or it's too pricey and i just refused to pay that amount but i tried these from aldi's and they were 579 and this bag is a 16 ounce bag so that wasn't bad at all i feel like that was a really good deal for the almonds all right and a serving is about um about one fourth of a cup and it says it's about 16 servings in here so that's that for 579 the almonds <clears throat> okay what else i got in here okay so then i got a pack of these um cranberry mix trail mix 
and it's eight in the pack and the trail mix was $3.59 for eight of them and um, let me open up this box I have not tasted these yet but this is what it looks like and in it it has peanuts cranberries and almonds all right so peanuts cranberries and almonds so I got that and then the next couple of items well no I'm not gonna try this I got these right here some dried cherries the dried cherries were um 349 yeah 349 for the dried cherries this is the brand right here all right so i got that and now the next couple of items i actually want to try on camera because i've never tried them before but look at this y'all i got the dark chocolate covered strawberry they're freeze dried and their chocolate covered strawberries. So I want to taste one. I want to taste one right now. Let me wash my hands. Let me see how much were these. The freeze dried strawberries were okay. Dry berries. Oh, okay, no. The dry berries were $2.49. I mixed it up. These were $2.49. And then the freeze dried strawberries, these was these are $349. Okay, $349. And then the next two items that I want to try are they were both um $579. So the first one is the keto coconut clusters. And y'all, I forgot to read all the nutritional information off of all these things. Y'all, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Okay. So this has pumpkin plus sunflower plus hemp seeds and i'm not on a keto diet but i felt that this was a healthier option than you know just eating regular junk food chips or something like that all right so i also got another one this one is the dark chocolate one it's the same thing and these again they were 579 each so this is the same thing but it's the dark chocolate so this has the pumpkin seeds sunflower and quinoa and dark chocolate so i'm gonna wash my hands y'all i keep baby i keep me some um sanitizer in here but this right here is straight straight alcohol <laughs> and i keep it in my car i do i sure do so i'm gonna wash my hands and then we're gonna taste this stuff okay so i'm gonna start with the chocolate covered strawberries i love chocolate covered strawberries so i hope that this is okay so this is what it looks like it smells pretty good can y'all see it almost it almost smells like raisins oh oh dog it oh man well at least y'all got to see it <laughs> okay let me show y'all but i'm not dropping this one y'all see that okay let me try it i am not gonna drop another one. Oh, i wanted that so bad okay here we go Let's let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. The chocolate tastes good. It's sweet. Hmm. You know what? It kind of tastes like um what are those things? Raisinets, and I love me some raisinets. That's what it kind of reminds me of. Now, at first, when I bit into it, the crunch kind of um took me aback. But um, once I started chewing it, I could taste the chocolate first, and of course, it's dark chocolate, so it has that little bitter aftertaste. But that's okay. All right. Well, I guess since we're still on a chocolate kick. I'm going to try these next. All right. Let's try these next. But would I get that again? Oh, yeah. I think that's good. How much is a serving? Because, baby, I sit there and eat the whole whole bag like, like raising next. A serving is a serving is a fourth cup. A fourth cup. 
and it says it's like four servings in this bag okay so how much is the serving on this one a half a cup and it says about 10 servings is in this bag and y'all look at the back all right it tells you what's in there so let me see all right i'm digging in i'm trying to get a small one oh it's kind of sticky like <gasps> oh y'all okay i can't do this in the car because i'm being too clumsy but a little piece is right here let me close that mm. um i don't know if i like that it's something that tastes a little bitter i mean i'm gonna eat them i got paper towel i'm gonna eat them but it's something that's the flavor is a little off on this would i get this one again i would not get this one again but i'm gonna eat them okay so let me see let me see how these taste <laughs> these are just the pumpkin seeds sunflower and hemp seeds and quinoa and the other one and hemp seeds they are very good for you all right oh i don't like the way that look i don't like the way that look y'all see that Mm, the color the color look like something all right i'm not gonna drop this one let me hold it with two hands let me show y'all look at this it doesn't look very um <laughs> appetizing so i just broke off a little piece so let's see who knows maybe looks can be deceiving It was definitely sweeter than the last one. I like this one better. It's more crunchy like a um peanut brittle. Peanut brittle. I don't know if y'all have a peanut brittle. That's what it kind of reminds me of. How crunchy it is. And it's sweet. It's very sweet. I could definitely taste the coconut. So, I like this one better than the other one. The other one wasn't bad, but I do like this one better. Yeah, I would I would get this one again. I'm not sure if I would get the dark chocolate one again. But everything else is good. The cereal was good. I've been having that with my coconut milk. Um, I'm not worried about the trail mix. I know the trail mix will be fine. The chocolate covered strawberries were good. And I know that the almonds and the agave neck there is good, but anyway so this was my health and wellness haul you all it is just so important that you take care of yourself and one of the things that i have to do to make sure that i am oh my goodness walking in my purpose of staying healthy is i have to monitor what i eat and it is hard it's that is a challenge for me especially if i have junk food in my house especially if i'm around people and they eating junk food so i just said you know what i need to nip this in the bud i need to be more consistent and more disciplined and just go ahead and put things in my presence buy snacks healthy snacks that i like and i will enjoy and then i will be less tempted to you know at the plum stone cold you know you know <laughs> i don't want to be out here acting up okay i want to do the right thing so that i can be here for my family and my friends and walk in my purpose so that is it y'all um tell me if you all have any other ideas of healthy snacks healthy options that i might enjoy leave it in the comment section below and you guys be blessed and i'll see you at the next video bye